Hi, I'm William Blaylock from Blaylock Productions. In preparation for their first game, the First Coast High School Buccaneer Band has high hopes to destroy the competition. With COVID-19 reigning and social distancing strictly enforced, can they power through this challenging time with confidence and energy? Stay tuned to find out. Unlike in previous years, when the band would line up in the student parking lot, march through the stadium entrance and onto the track, this year they'll line up in C Hall, march towards the back of the school, past the portables, behind the concession stands, and onto the track. To ensure everyone's safety, stadium capacity has been reduced to 30% to stay within local guidelines. As a result, the band will sit on the track near the shipyard scoreboard.
last measure. One, two, open it up. One, two, ready, and. Hi, I'm Terrius Cohen, former drum major at First Coast High School and second year band member of the Pride at BCU. I know for a fact you all will kill Creekside tonight. Things come to those who wait. Just don't procrastinate. Hey, I know you'll do great. Peace. For this game, the opposing team's band is a no-show. The First Coast band does not have a field show ready. Again, this game. Weird enough though, halftime will be 30 long minutes. Bring it back! Bring it back! Bring it back! Bring it back! One, two, three, four!
Greetings, my name is Mia Thomas and I served as the head drum major at First Coast High School for two years before graduating in 2019. I'm the proud creator of Janae's Crochets, a black owned business where all crochets are made with love and positive energy. Now let me tell you something First Coast, I believe that you all will encounter much success in tonight's game. And before I sign off, I have to give a shout out to Mr. Ken of Solomon, the best band director in the land. Go Bucks!
Shipyard's first game. Football team zero to 35 against Creekside. The band does need work, but I do feel confident that they will succeed in their next two games. Again, this is William Blaylock of Blaylock Productions.